What's up, y'all? Let's all take a moment before, before I start this video to enter ourselves into the present moment. Let's all stop and breathe in. Breathe out. You see that? Now we're in the present moment. We're in line with everything that's around us. Now, for the topic of today's video, I'm going to be addressing the Sakhel Chakra. One of the most powerful chakras that you have in your body. And I mean, this chakra is very powerful and very useful. Because with the Sakhel Chakra, what it does is that it helps you be more creative and more passionate about your life. And it helps you get that balance of sexual energy, you know? For, so, like, for example, you, you, your Sakhel Chakra, let's say, here's how it would be passionate. You could, go, you could just be going and mowing your grass, and it will help you be more passionate. You, and you will be enjoying your life in general a lot more. And also, for say, if you're a YouTuber, if you're a YouTuber, this could be very helpful for you, or if there's any content creator in general. You can go and put all that creative energy towards your videos. Because that sexual energy, think about it. That sexual energy has the power to create a whole other human being. Just imagine what, what you could do with that energy if you put it towards your YouTube videos. Your YouTube videos would be outstanding quality content if they, if they aren't already. Hopefully they are, because I, I know y'all got to be good. You know? And also, here's how you know if your Sakhel Chakra would be unbalanced, unaligned. You know? Your Sakhel Chakra would, I mean, well, yeah, with your Sakhel Chakra, you, you would have a lot of fear and a lot of guilt in an unbalanced sex type, unbalanced sexual energy. You know, like, let's say you had the fear of, like, like, fear, like, of going to a new school or, or new neighborhood, fear like that, that's for example, fear, you know? And also, if I didn't mention this before, your Sakhel Chakra is located between your navel, which is your belly button, and your genitalia, which is, you know what it is, there's no need to explain that, you know? But when you have your Sakhel Chakra aligned, you can do a lot of positive things, a lot of good and creative things, not just for you, but for the people around you, because remember, when you take care of yourself, you also take care of the people around you, keep that in mind. And also, what I did to get my root chakra in line is that I went and I recommend meditating minds. That's what I use for, for my meditation when in line, my sakhel chakra. Y'all can use whatever you want, whatever you vibe with. Remember, we're all different. We offer our own different journey and unique path. But I, I recommend just going and doing that one with a, with a sakhel chakra and, and going like this. Speaking out for your meditation universe, I wish I have a good high vibrational meditation and get good progress in aligning my Sakhel Chakra. And and then once you've done that, I want you to, then once in, what you done that, what I do is I close my eyes, I, I breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, breathe out. And I'm and I'm not just breathing, I'm breathing in white energy. Imagine white energy, breathe in, breathe out neg negative energy. I'm getting that energy balance between the yin and yang. Good good and bad and just bad and good, you know? Stuff like that. And then, and then once I start meditating, and I start laying my mind sinking to a deep state, I make sure I'm consciously breathing, being aware. Because the, one of the main things with meditation is being aware in the pre, in a present moment while you're doing all that. And I already know this question is coming. How do I help with my thoughts? Because I'll be struggling with my thoughts. One thing you can do to help with your thoughts is just remember this quote. Let your thoughts come and go, but do not stop and serve them any tea. And, and what I mean by this is, what I mean by this is, is that when you're meditating and all those thoughts are coming in, just go and let them come and go as they be. Don't stop and pay them any attention to mind. Just keep focusing on your breathing and being in the present moment of your meditation. You know. Let's see. I'm pretty sure I covered all the sorts of things about the psychology I want to talk about. Where it's located at. What it does, how it's unaligned, what, is, what is happens when it's unaligned, what happens when it is aligned, and how you get it balanced. Well, and also for me, I got my balance since since I already had a struggle with pornography before I started NoFab. Oh yeah, NoFab would help with this a lot. It, it just goes hand in hand with NoFab. Because when you're of course free management, you're wasting all your sexual energy on nothing. You know? Just, just for that six just for that six Moments of pleasure, you know, when it, when it could be put towards way greater things. 
So, yeah, I think that mm, that about covers everything I want to talk about with the Sakhal Chakra. Now, he, now I want to talk about something a little bit different. Uh, as you see, I have a new necklace on here. I just want to tell y'all, this is a point pen on um, crystal necklace. And it, what it does is, when you walk in the room, all the negativity that's in there, it absorbs and recycles it into positive energy. I didn't know crystal could do that. that. That's crazy to me. I love it. I feel good. I feel good about wearing it. And one thing I wanted to talk about was driving meditation. Because I learned about this yesterday in, in a book I'm reading with that's called Peace is, is Every Step, which is a very good positive book. I recommend you guys read it. And basically what happens is while you're driving and you stop at a red light, you just go and stop, you breathe in, breathe out, and smile. Because in, because in that little like 20 seconds that you're at that stoplight, that gives you the time to be, to be like, wow, I'm really, I'm really here. You're in the present moment like I'm alive. I'm grateful that I'm alive. I'm grateful that I have the opportunity to see another day. And, you, and that, that gives you a lot of gratitude and a lot of, a lot of joyfulness and happiness in your life that you, that you may or may not have had before. I just thought that was something very interesting that I wanted to share with y'all. Well, that's it in the video. I may be dropping videos sometime next week, but, but I will always be dropping the video every single Friday for the, for the next for, for the next five weeks about the, about the seven main chakras. All right. I hope you all have a wonderful, I mean, a wonderful rest of your day. I love y'all. I really mean it on my heart. I, I love you guys. Peace out.